Thanks for joining me. Here what we're looking at on the flat earth information that we were covering in the previous video. So if you haven't seen one of these videos before, I recommend you go back to my channel, hit the videos button, and catch up on what we were talking about here. What you have is the divine masculine and the divine feminine. This would be like lit up and this would be black because it's the black hole sun, the abyss. You can see it over here on the electric book. You see that this is like Sauron's eye. You can see over here, it's missing one wave. That's the feminine hole. If it's pointing up, it's the masculine. See the L for like lesbian, it's cross confused. You see over here, the one wave. Okay, the, what's happened is this, half of this has been shut off. Um, like you see over here on the HIV thing, that's one color. It's supposed to be one red, one blue wave. You see over here, that's turned sideways, okay? It's cross and confused because it's either a feminine or it's pointing up and a masculine, all right? You see the seal of Saturn, which is the number sign turned sideways. Jesus is clearly Saturn or Satan. I don't make crosses and you can see over here, I don't make these things either. And you can see the seal of Saturn right there. You can see the seal of Saturn right there. You can see it on your tile. You can see it everywhere, people. It's on everything. Everything is, see, like circle jerking, and this is that sound you make when, all right? Um, everybody is cross and confused and missing half of their brain. They can't see what's hiding in plain sight. So let's go over what that is, hiding in plain sight. You see Trap Queen, that new song? A trap is a female with a penis. Your tie is either a noose or a, it's your limp dick. Sort of like your graduation hat has that thing hanging off it. Uh, it's in the shape of an L. So flags are for fags because you add one letter to it, the L, which would be lesbian or limp and confused. That's what they're telling you right over here. You're bent and confused. You're missing half of your brain. There's supposed to be two waves here. You're on planet X, cross and confused, clearly. Outer space does not exist. You're under a dome. Okay. Your three-dimensional body would be in the abyss. Light comes out of a black hole. On the other side is a light hole. You would need to go through the darkness, turn your consciousness into your heart at death, and say, take me home like Dorothy through the tornado back to your three-dimensional body. You either fell in, jumped in, you were pushed in, you were taken. However, you got onto this gridiron and caught in this cube. All right? I am not saying this place was always like this. Some people say the Demiurge is where it all went bad when the Archons got here. And they're the ones who turned everything and shut off this so that we couldn't sense them. And we we're missing half of our, you know, you're missing all your magical powers now. And it's being rubbed in your face. The reason they're pushing this transgender stuff is because you're cross and confused. That's what it means, people. You're not a plus, balanced. It's clearly showing you on the word kosher. Uh, where's the word? Hold on, let me find that. Here it is, right over here. What's kosher is when you go up her sock, that's kosher. The earth is supposed to be the shape of a Vesca Pisces. Now, with one, you're born into sin. You're missing half of your brain, and now it's a hole, like an asshole. When you wink, that's your asshole, your brown eye. So a cyclops and all that stuff is referring to your... Your brown eye, it's all homosexual magic, just like comets and meteors. There's a dome up there, people. Comets and meteors, and that's like raining men. That's like I showed in a previous video, all right? In a previous video, I mentioned how your food can be dragged across water using only a neodymium magnet. So what you want to do is you want to take... Any one of your dry foods, drop it on water. Make sure you're using a neodymium magnet. I've stacked a whole bunch here because I give these things out to people. And you'll see that the type of iron that you would want in your diet is the type that's bioavailable, where a plant draws it through the soil and processes it, and then you eat the plant and get a processed form of the iron or heavy metal. Here, that's not bioavailable. That's because... When you die, you'll have a magnetic residue, which will keep you trapped to the gridiron. And you'll be avoiding the light and the Pac-Man moon, which is going to come around 
and try and eat your soul. That's what they're telling you, people. They're rubbing it in your face. Uh, Skynet, Judgment Day, that's all old news, people. That's all been set up now. Pac-Man and all that stuff is set up to catch you. That's, that's what's happened. There's an electromagnetic field that keeps you from getting back to your three-dimensional body. That's why they want you to fear the abyss. It's got the symbols right over there, people. This is Satan right there. See it? That's a, that's a symbol of Saturn. Saturn is Satan. Clearly. That's what they're showing you. Everything you know is a lie, people. The idea would be to get back to your three-dimensional body. Dark matter, gray matter. The reason it's gray matter, like 50 shades of gray. If you're like sketchers, you're sketchy, crossed and confused, you're cloudy, gray. That's what gray matter is because you're confused. Dark matter... Because you need that your three dimensional body is controlling your avatar from the other side. So dark matter is your brain, and dark energy is your intent that causes the wave function to collapse and snap into position. Your light body is on the other side. You're here, trapped in the black hole sun. You're a shadow of yourself now. Everybody knows not even light can escape the black hole sun. So maybe every I've got it in reverse that. The point I'm trying to make is here is that part of you is on the other side of there and part of you is stuck over here, trapped, separated from each other. The idea would be to get out to your three-dimensional body, which is on the other side of that black hole. You are sucked into the black hole. You're trapped here on the gridiron, born, uh, you're born into this place. The biophotons of your mother and the biophotons of your father came together to trap you here on the gridiron. You're brought to life by way of the sun. And this line down here, which makes the sine wave, is showing you like the dollar sign. Okay, this is the sine wave. Time is money. Okay, that's the sine wave. You can see it's clearly missing one wave, or otherwise it would be the other. That's because if you were whole and complete, you wouldn't be using money. We need to get rid of time and money. Time and money is what makes you a slave. Everything needs to be free. If there's 7 billion people on the planet, 5 billion of us maybe could work one hour a week. That gives us 5 billion man hours a week. If everybody wants a, man, a mansion, then we'll put half of the people into the building sector. Everybody works a week, we'll build mansions. Uh, whatever it is, people, there's enough people here, and you just need to choose right. See, so like, choose has the two, it's like the Vesca Pisces, and you see lose only has one. It's you're missing half of your brain. You shouldn't have to choose between eating and a prescription or your kids having new shoes and whatever. To make a choice, you don't really have a choice. A choice, it's all been set up for you. Uh, to, to become a full-fledged witch, you would need to kiss the devil's asshole. Clearly, that's the horns. You're kissing the asshole. Your food is killing you. It's all your food. Your GMOs, everything. You're only kidding yourself, people. Look up the Codex Alimentarius. You'll see that they're... You're being systematically murdered and you can't see it. This stuff is being rubbed in your face. Okay, you see this stuff. AIDS is a hoax. You see the symbol right there telling you it's a hoax. It's inescapable. Type in AIDS is a hoax. Type in the presidential assassinations are a hoax. Type in Malaysia. Uh, type in Carlisle Group murders Malaysian passengers over patent. A military patent, which they're going to use to destroy the Hoover Dam. That's what some people are saying. See the virus over there in the cube? The cube or the matrix is a reflection of you. And that's why they're putting all this shit over here because they're trying to make it reflect you. You have to acquiesce, okay? You have to acquiesce to bumping and grinding on each other and going, see this is the masculine, a bud light. That's, that doesn't go along with a bud, bud light. Pauly girl, those two things don't go together. Okay, beer, queer. Now listen, I have nothing against gay people. You think you're gay because you wanted to be gay? No, they poisoned you, people. They made you gay by design, using chemicals in your baby food. And sure, you like it, but listen, people, you think it's healthy to show your children all this stuff? You're in Sodom and Gomorrah. Make no mistake about it. Like I said, I don't have anything against homosexuals. This is all by design. They're making lots of money on you because AIDS is a hoax. Look it up. 100% preventable because it's a hoax. It's a whole bunch of money that they're making on you. That's what they've done. You're just, it's a, your life is a game to them. And you just don't see it. You think I'm cracking on you because I don't like... No, listen, people, you're mistaken. You do what you want behind closed doors. You don't put it in your children's faces. 
Okay, this is all done by the skull and crossbones. See? 322. Two. This is being forced on you, people. You're being X-Men on purpose. They're making you the female chromosome. They're, they're making... See this? This is not a Vesca Pisces, the shape of a woman's vagina. This is all rubbed in your face. You guys are the lab rats, like somebody pointed out. Ball in reverse is lab. You're the lab rats. So let's take a look at this. Your three-dimensional body is on the other side of the abyss. You would need to get through the abyss. They don't want you to open up the abyss because then your three-dimensional body will come through, grab you, and you'll break free of the matrix. Van Allen belts are clearly these extensions over here to keep you from going around and getting back to the black hole sun and circumventing the trap or the cage. Clearly, Jesus is, you got the seal of Saturn, and you again, you see the seal of Saturn on the thing. It's, it's rubbed in your face, people. You were born onto, it's the grid. You were trapped on the gridiron. That's what it's a symbol of. You wear it on your head when you graduate. You see this skull and crossbones and all your kids' stuff? You're the antimatter. The real matter is on the other side of the black hole. And, or something like that. That's what I'm, it, it appears that that's what's going on. That we're separated from half of our, our, of our, we're only a shadow of ourselves because the other half of us is on the other side of that black hole. You're in the carbon 666 avatar. And your brain is being remotely operated from another dimension on the other side of there. All these different layers are layered up on top of here. On top of this grid is a bunch of different dimensions stacked on top of each other. Cream rises to the top. It's not gravity, it's density, electromagnetism, and pressure. Gravity was only created to explain why you weren't flying off the Earth as it was spinning around at a thousand miles an hour. The Earth is stationary. It's fixed. And what we need to do is circle the square. Everybody's been squared. That's what your graduation hat is telling you. And now everybody needs to unite peacefully and circle the square. Get your divine feminine back. That's why they show you Godzilla as this angry monster. That's the divine feminine. But the divine feminine is what saves the earth. Godzilla saved the earth. You're missing half of your brain. You need your other half of the brain back. And then you're able to, to become whole and complete and see things. Now listen, people. I love you. We're in this shit together. We need to stick together for our survival. Again, I don't have anything against gay people. I'm telling you that this is all by design.